Um, since we um, are talking about fruit, I thought it might be appropriate to speak about this work, untitled work by the Belgian-Romanian painter Simona Mihaela Stoia. I think one might say that this evocation of a fruit tree consists of very vigorous brush strokes, bold brush strokes, and as we can see the suggestion of the presence of a lemon in the middle, or the suggestion of a lemon in the middle, is repeated in other instances in the painting, but where the suggestion is less, where in the, this, the lemon in the middle contains a shadow part at the right side and then a lighter and lit part on the left side. It seems to have some shadow at the bottom as well. Whereas the other figures become more and more mere paint. Um, you have the lemon to the left that also has a suggestion of light but if the painting would be realistic, the light would not be able to be different. Uh, in that case, all the light and all the shadows should behave in the same manner, but they don't. And as such, the painting reveals to be made out of paint and brush strokes, and to be a painting and not a representation of fruit. Um, we see several degrees of this evolution here in the most realistic lemon, this one which is more vague, this one which with very bold suggestion of light that is um, illogical if you see the other one, this green lemon and then the occurrence of a mere yellow stain. Impossible to film here I see. In reality it's yellow, yeah, the yellow appears more or less, seems to be greenish, but it's re really a beautiful reddish yellow. Parts of the background have been treated, as in the 17th century, and have not been covered anymore. Giving a kind of, give, um, conveying depth to the painting, and indeed we see an illusion of depth and a play with the illusion of depth in paintings using merely green with some purple shadow parts and some brown here ochre repeating the theme of the background very tiny details making the painting very rich in its totality. Simona Mihaila Stoyak.